So here we are, the last of the lightweight contest we will see in cage number two today. This, the semi-final that we'll see. That man, Z Machado from Portugal, take on the rising star, one of the great hopes from the UK, from England, George Staines. Staines in the red corner, red and white kit. Taking on Z Machado from Portugal. He is in the red kit. Green and gold, a little premature start there. <laughs> Just checking everyone's in place. Off we go. Lightweight quarterfinals here. George Staines, 10 and 0. 10 and 0 as an amateur. Claimed his victory yesterday. Out grappled his man, took a big shot in the, at the start. Said himself he just wasn't quite switched on, but he looks super switched on and prepared today. Showed off his grappling yesterday, and he's going to need that against this man, Z Machado. Machado got a submission finish yesterday. He got that over Oscar Lang from Denmark. Worked hard for it. Powering his man to the mat is Z Machado, but Staines so composed, so many weapons in his arsenal. You look at his grappling, so evolved, so technical so dangerous then you look at his striking equally so every weapon absolutely sharp you see that in the corner the england coaches such a quality set of staff that they've got helping and guiding these athletes through and stain's now looking to reverse this takedown with it, to make it a takedown of his own Saw a little interview with him yesterday and he was absolutely buzzing. He talk, oh, he talked about being a happy guy and loving life and then that walk to the cage, just a mist coming over him where he's looking to absolutely destroy his opponents with a smile on his face. That has become a trademark of his. And Z Machado now feeling this top pressure, this pressure against the cage. Staines trained out of that AVT gym. What a gym that is up there in Leeds. Such quality fighters, coaches. Danny Mitchell up there, as well as Jay Furness. Head pressure, nice frames from Staines. And Z Machado doing well to avoid this takedown. Good strength, good balance from the Portuguese fighter. Now trying to make space and does so. Whee! Up comes the kick. Oh, he's charging forward. Low kick turns him around. A little slip there from Staines. And now, it's this, now it is exactly what the corner said. This is a scramble. This is where it's on. Z Machado hanging onto that neck. No. You can see now Staines trying to force it way through bit by bit, that head popping out. Now he gets a bite on the neck. And he charged forward that low kick, spun Z Machado around. George Staines followed him in. Then a little slip allowed Z Machado to take the top position, so take the submission attempt anyway. Oh, nice level change of takedown from Z Machado there. One round down, one round down between these two. This will see who will move on to take on the Irishman, Ronan Deegan, in the next fight. Either one of these moving forward would be tantalizing to picture that matchup, but they have got each other to deal with first. And this young man, he's got one of the most unassuming, humble personalities outside the cage, but having had the pleasure of calling one of his fights back in the UK. He absolutely switches it on when that cage door shuts. His dedication, belief, and then skill set second to none. And highly touted as one of the best prospects to come out of England. Z Machado, though, has IMAF experience under his belt before. He's been here before. He's faced tough competition before yesterday. He got that finish against Oscar Lang. And you cannot doubt his skill set either. Look at that. He's trying to set up that overhand right now for the shorter fighter against the taller fighter. That, that right hand can be crypt tonight. 
throwing it over the top, over that lead hand, trying to connect with the chin. Oh, quick, quick entry, but equally quick hips there from Staines. Oh, look at that. Rides and rolls with his man. Now brings him to the mat. Look at that reaps the leg, ties that up as well. Looking to use that to work to the back, but good work from Z Machado. Controlled the arm, knew what to do. This is a technical chess match between the two. Clinch, oh, good knees, wow. Wow, indeed. Trying to bully his man to the mat. Now it is about the scramble again because Machado's got that underhook. But look at that, the posture of Staines. Now the frame. And those clinch, those Muay Thai clinch knees. Oh, Thai plum knees. Well, lovely in between a flurry of attacks. Now Staines. Now Staines with more head pressure. Halfway through round two. Let's see, Staines looks to, yeah, he's done that. He's tied up the leg, he'll look to run the pipe, turn the corner, try and get his man to the mat off that cage. Or maybe even a little trip. Yeah, nice technical advice there from the, the corner. They want him higher with that underhook. That affects the balance, the posture of the opponent. Good position able to contain the Portuguese fighter for the first time in this round for some time now now dropping for the single yet again got to watch the neck on the outside though try to pull those hands together oh, that's the danger that is the danger Z Machado trying to squeeze on that he's he, he saw that he's trying to push that now stains a little bit of urgency Z Machado squeezing with all his might. This would be huge if he can get the finish. Oh, Staines is out. Wow. But that makes the round interesting. That makes the round interesting. That attack, certainly a good bite on the next stain. Staying composed. Only he will know how deep that was. Oh, and a nice triple throw there from the Portuguese fighter, Z Machado. Interesting second round indeed. You had the pressure. Staines looking up, looking up to his uh, his corner. But that guillotine and then the uh, the throw at the end makes it a little bit interesting anyway. Three minutes now. Three minutes. Z Machado against George Staines, England versus Portugal. And the final instructions from the corner, as you can tell, there's some intensity. Just trying to make those final adjustments, fill those lungs with air fill the mind with confidence as they step out into round three here we go the crowd as well listen to them listen to them portugal versus england portugal's z machado looking for the takedown early great spoil from england's george Staines. but again the attack the relentless pressure from z machado Staines has got to work trying to frame away maybe try and Get that knee shield in, push away, Z Machado. <laughs> Machado. Staines now trying to use that cage to wall walk. Can he do that? Just maintaining the control here. Z Machado stains now. I'm trying to use. He's got the knee shield and he needs space. Still forward pressure from Z Machado. One minute 50 seconds. 50, one minute 50 seconds. 
Staines has got to try and reverse this spot, or find a way to attack off his back. There we go, now he's trying to shift the hips. Machado just staying stuck to him. This again, a real close contest. Staines has got to make space. You see, he's trying to push away, gets back to the cage. Oh, he's going under. He's going under and round. That's, that's what he's looking for. Great work from Staines to his knees. Now he's got to engage, got to avoid that guillotine attempt. He respected that bite on the neck, though. Now, Z Machado on the back of George Staines, the corner there. Saying Staines has got to get up 45 seconds. And Z Machado is just stuck to Staines like glue in this third round. Didn't quite get the first takedown attempt, made the second one work. Staines back to his feet and trying to stay on his feet as Machado pulls and rags and tries to drag his man down. Staines is dropped for a, a leg attack. Now the scramble's on. Staines steps over. 15 seconds to go. Looking and again Machado responds. Oh my goodness. Digging it deep is the Portuguese fighter avoiding that top position from Staines. And there we have it, three rounds in the bags. Both believe they've done enough. Got his hands held high. He thinks he's done enough through rounds one and round two. Machado has received that Portuguese flag as he thinks he's done enough as well. Wow. Wow. This is a close one to call. Respect between fighters, corners, countrymen. <laughs> Honestly. Let's see, will Staines go to 11 and 0 or will Z Machado? <laughs> little dance from Staines. <laughs> There we go, 11 and 0, George Staines, he said who cares if it's a decision, it's a win, he feels he's done enough, the Portuguese fighter, disappointed but the winner, the winner and moving forward is George Staines, 11 and 0, the English hopes still lie in the corner of that guy.